More than 100 kids went fishing with a guide for the 33rd annual Take a Kid Fishing event in Bemidji. Kids met at Cameron Park and spent the day on the lake. Reporter Malak Katab shares with us why fishing guides keep coming back to the event. Bill Kane has been a guide since Take a Kid Fishing began 33 years ago. His favorite part about the organization? These guys, they're just fun. It's just fun taking kids out and showing them how to do stuff. Watching them, they just have fun doing piddly little things that I take it for granted. Each guide had two kids to a boat. Eric Nevins has been a guide since 2005. He says it's a great experience to take kids who otherwise don't have the opportunity to go fishing on a regular basis. To see the excitement of catching a fish, whether it's three inches long or 30 inches long, just to see that excitement again. Because sometimes I fish a lot, so sometimes you forget that every fish is a trophy. Some of the kids participating have never fished before, and other kids keep coming back to the event. I had a blast today. Me and my friend over there caught over 50 walleyes, and I got four sheep heads and, and one one perch and one northern. One guide has been volunteering with Take a Kid Fishing for the past 20 years. He says the best thing is the enthusiasm kids have to want to go fishing. Definitely teaching them skills on uh, how to fish, what to do, you can't keep everything, catch and release. We talk about invasive species. So, I mean, it's the whole gamut, and hopefully it will help preserve fishing in the future. Take a Kid Fishing started because a group of fishermen wanted to preserve the traditions of fishing. The best way to experience that is with the kids from 10 to 15 years of age, where they're just getting into something that they really want. So they really wanted to make sure the sport continued. Kids and their fishing guide met back at Bemidji State Park where they cleaned their fish, took pictures with their guide, and had a fish fry celebration. Reporting in Bemidji, Malak Katab, Lakeland News. Two kids at the event received a lifetime fishing license after they were nominated by their fishing guides. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.